हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल एजुकेशन डब्ल्यू एम एच इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस ग्रेड एट मैथमेटिक्स फर्स्ट टर्म टेस्ट पेपर फॉर द अपकमिंग टर्म टेस्ट आई इनवाइट यू टू सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल एंड वॉच मोर वीडियोस यू कैन डाउनलोड दिस पेपर फ्रॉम द लिंक गिवन इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन फर्स्ट सेक्शन Write the next two terms of the number pattern. We are given the number pattern twenty five, twenty three, twenty one. What is the common difference uh, between each two consecutive terms here? Twenty one and twenty three minus two. Here also minus two. So we have to subtract two from this one. Then nineteen, nineteen minus uh, two is seventeen. Then question number two. We are given this diagram. Find the perimeter of the figure. Uh, two sides are given equal here, so we have to add the add all the lengths here, add all surrounding lengths. Then. Uh, Twelve plus eight plus eight is sixteen. Then uh, ten plus fifteen. The total is fifty-three. Fifty-three centimeters. Then question number three. Uh, find the value of x. As the given uh, two uh, lines are straight lines, vertically opposite tang uh, angles are formed here. There are two pairs. Uh, one can be taken as uh, the uh, the two given angles. So we can equal x plus twenty degrees equal to eighty degree. Then x equals eighty minus twenty. That is sixty degree. Fourth question: Give two examples for platonic solids. There are five platonic solids. We'll recall them: regular tetrahedron, cube, regular octahedron, then regular dodecahedron, and regular icosahedron. Question number five. Write uh, first two terms of three n minus one. How to take each term? To take the first term, we'll write it as t one. We have to substitute n uh, one for n here. So three multiplied by one minus one. Three minus one is uh, two. Then t two equal to Three multiplied by two minus one. Six minus one is five. Question number six. Arrange in ascending order. Ascending order means smallest one to the largest one. What is the smallest one here? Five point six seven. Five point six seven. Then. Uh, seven hundred grams equal to seven kilograms. Then we can write that. Then uh, eight point six seven. Eight point six seven. That is in kilogram. Then eight hundred seventy six kilograms. Question number seven. Construct an algebraic expression. Construct an algebraic expression. For the total amount required to buy two kilogram of flour, of which one kilogram is x, if we want to buy two kilograms, then that is two x plus five hundred gram of sugar, of which one kilogram is y, then y should be divided by two. And two hundred gram of tea leaves of Which one kilogram equals Z? Then Z should be divided by four. 
then question number 8 remove the brackets uh, 5 times 2x minus 3 5 times 2x minus 3 when removing the bracket each term inside the bracket should be multiplied by the number or term in uh, outside the bracket so 5 multiplied by 2x is 10x then minus sign comes here 5 multiplied by 3 is 15 question number 9 find the value of square root of 100 over 9 this is a fraction so we can take the square root separately square root of 100 is 10 then square root of 9 is 3 we can write it as a mixed number 3 1 over 3 question number 10 write the number of triangles of the figure triangles with one smaller triangles is 4 here then triangles with uh, two smaller triangles is 3 triangles with three smaller triangles is 2 with four small triangles is 1 so the addition is 4 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1 then what is the addition 10 so 10 triangles are there then question number 11 the sum of two consecutive square numbers is 61 write the two square numbers first uh, we'll write some square numbers uh, from 1 1 4 9 16 25 then 36 if you add these two square numbers what is the addition 25 plus 61 uh, 36 the addition is 61 then the answer is 21 25 and 36 these are the two square numbers which the addition equal to 61 then question number 12 find the value of value when 15 degrees is added to the complement of 60 degrees what is the complement of 60 degrees? That is 30 degrees. So 30 degrees plus 12 degrees. That is 42 degrees. Question number 13. Find the value of minus 7 into 0 into minus 12. If you multiply any number by 0, you get a you get 0 as the answer. So, answer is 0. No need to multiply these two. Question number 14. Find the value of 2x plus 6 when x equals minus 2. 2x plus 6. We have to substitute the given value for x here. 2x means 2 multiplied by x. 2 multiplied by minus 2 plus 6. 2 multiplied by minus 2 is minus 4. Minus 4 plus 6. The answer is plus 2. Question number 15. Add uh, two expressions x plus 2 and 2x plus 1. These are the two expressions. We can take the like terms together here and the numerical values together x plus 2x plus 2 plus 1 here x plus 2x is 3x then 2 plus 1 is 3 so this is the answer question number 16 find the 30th triangular number 
38 triangular number can be found by 30 multiplied by the next number 31. Then divide by 2. 2 times 1, 2 times 15. 15 multiplied by 31. That is 465. You have to multiply this and take the answer. Then question number 17. We are given this diagram. This uh, It has a relationship here. Uh, here in the middle we have 54. Then 9 times 6 is 54. So here we have 72. So to get 72 we have to multiply 9 by 8. Then uh, here the answer is 8. Then we have 8 and 6 in, in the middle multiplication of these two numbers that is 48. We can feel like this. Question number 18. X squared minus XY. Uh, write this as a product of two factors. We can uh, take the common uh, factor as X. X can be taken out. So, x squared divided by x is x. Then x minus xy divided by x is minus y. This is the, uh, this is the answer. These two are the two factors here. Question number 19. Find the value of 2.56 multiplied by 100. When a decimal number is multiplied by a power of 10, the decimal point, point goes uh, number of places to the right side. As this has two zeros, uh, it goes two places to the right side. So the answer is 256. Question number 20. Write two possible digits in the unit place uh, of a perfect square. In a perfect square, we can have these digits. 1, 4, 9, 6, 5 and 0. You can write 2 of them. 